Hello everyone and welcome to my channel. In this video I will show you a great plugin you can use in Unreal Engine 5 to make your projects a little bit easier. It only costs $10 or €11 Euros and even goes on sale from time to time. This plugin is called IA Scatter and it is made by a small studio called Erisin Atinum. I'm not sure I pronounce it right, but I will leave a link to their website in the description so you can check them out. The plugin is also available on Blender, but for this video I will stay in Unreal. The goal of this plugin is to help you scatter any objects on any surfaces and offer an alternative to foliage mode. Foliage mode is amazing, but it can be a bit impractical in some cases. For example, if you want to scatter rocks around, you can very quickly get going. But if you want to adjust anything, you have to go back and tweak the settings before scattering the rocks. For instance, if I wanted to change the scale, uh, it doesn't work. I have to remove them and paint again. Now, let's say you're happy about the results, but for some reason later on in the project, you feel that the asset you used is not the right one for your scene. You can swap the asset, but if the scale is not working because the asset is very different, you have to start again and paint your new asset. IA Scatter allows you to keep a non-destructive workflow to the end of your project. If you're coming from Blender, think of it as uh, GeoNodes. You can also convert the system to real objects thanks to the built-in convert tool. Of course, it is not meant to replace foliage mode, but depending on your specific need, it can be a great tool to have. The way it works is pretty simple. In the Epic Games launcher, go to your library, then add the plugin to one of your projects. In Unreal, you will see a dedicated folder in the content browser. Here you will find a blueprint that you can simply drag and drop into your scene. You can use the translate tools as usual, but for scaling, you must go to the panel on the right where you will find all the parameters. By the way, there is a helpful document on the studio's website with information on every parameter. I will put the link in the description. Let's say you want to scatter rocks around, you can use the planner mode to get going quickly and then adjust the scale and add random rotation to make it more natural. You can also use the spline distribution methods to scatter around a more precise path. If you need to avoid a certain object, add this physical material to the object in the select do not populate in your scatter system. To avoid overlapping, select method 2 and tweak the distance value. By the way, if you want to hide this uh, little bit annoying UI element, you can go to the editor billboard scale value here and type 0. Alternatively, you can make very interesting structures by turning off overlapping detection and turning on trace complex. Add more meshes to your system and admire the monstrosity you've just created. Let's get cucumbers in there. Perfect. There are a lot of possibilities here, but if you want a more serious example of interesting setups, have a quick look at this trailer the studio published recently. We have also a 30 minute video about all the parameters that covers everything you need to know. Overall, IA Scatter is a great and affordable plugin for Unreal Engine 5 that can make your scattering workflow much easier and more flexible. Whether you are making games or focusing on cinematics, this plugin is definitely worth checking out. I will put a link to the marketplace in the description of this video, along with all the other resources I talked about earlier. If you have any questions about this plugin, ask them in the comments below and I will do my best to answer them. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a like and consider subscribing for future content. This is my first video, so any feedback is welcome. Bye.